Hey everyone, Old Man Mordaith here and welcome to another Crusader Quickies. Today we're going to be talking about development and often overlooked by new player feature uh, mechanic, but it's still very important, I think, as a lot of veterans would attest to. So, if you find this video helpful, feel free to like, subscribe, hit the notification button. I'm trying to do regular videos of this kind, short form, to get to the point and uh, help you learn the game. So, development, as I mentioned, is very important. It shows how sophisticated your country's... Uh, uh, counties, sorry, counties infrastructure and technological development is. If you want to see your development score, you're going to want to click on the county and you'll see it right here, development, and currently we are at 11. Development ranges from 0 to 100 points and if you are tribal, feudal, or clan, every point in development will grant you an increase to your supply limit in that county by 150 points. If you are feudal or clan, every point of development additionally will grant you 0.5% boost in your taxes and levy rates for that county. So that's more money, more, more soldiers. Very, very important. To increase your development to the next level, for in our case, from 11 to 12, uh, in this example, you need to accumulate growth points. Uh, and you can see right here, as we cursor over the development score, you can see development growth is currently 26 out of 100 and shows you everything that's uh, interacting and adding to our growth rate. Every month that growth rate increases, uh, once it hits 100, you go, go up to the next level of development. You go from, in this case, from 11, you would go to 12. Growth is slow uh, overall. Uh, increasing your development is a very slow process, but high development counties can spread development to lower development counties and you can see over here we can see from neighbors an increase of 0 0.3 so your development will spread outward it will radiate from a high development area let's see various items including skills innovations and uh, talents can add uh, increased development growth and one of the most important things you can do is the assigned counselor task over here in your counselors, uh, under your steward, he has access to increased development in county. Now, it will grant a significant boost to the development of a county, uh, but when you apply it, you're going to maybe notice, in this case here, you will notice a, in, in red letters, existing development. So essentially what this means, it's a, it's a weird mechanic, a weirdly worded mechanic, it essentially means your court, uh, your uh, counselor will get diminishing returns on this task the more uh, developed uh, the target county is. So the higher the tech rating is, the higher the development rating is in a county, the less effective your counselor is going to be at improving it. Now, this can be mitigated because in each era, there is an innovation that allows the counselor to operate more effectively, uh, uh, more effectively help high development count, uh, uh, counties. Uh, if we look over here in our innovations, we'll look over at the medieval version, which was Public Works. Uh, public Works increases the maximum existing development penalty at 20. So it basically me makes that threshold higher and higher. Now, one important note, and I don't know if it's working as intended, uh, is if, as of the recording of this video, it seems to be that the... Uh, culture of your counselor, the council, uh, the culture of your steward is going to be the determining factor of whether you have access to these innovations. So if you have a Franconian uh, uh, steward, for example, he'll have access to uh, the public works, but he won't have access to uh, uh, whatever the next one is. Uh, coinage? No, I, I can't remember which one. It's one of these ones. Ah, right here, communal government. Uh, but this guy is Dutch. And the Dutch actually do have access to communal government. So that actually makes him a more effective counselor. Anyway, just a little interesting uh, note on development. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. Thank you very much. If there's any more questions, feel free to leave them in the comments down below.